Hey guys, in this lesson, I want to go over how you can fix a corrupted central file using your local files. Now, keep in mind, if you have ever seen this prompt come up, which in essence says that this central file has been copied or moved from its local area, if you want it to remain the central file, then resave the file as a central file. This is saying that someone has disconnected from the network, or detached the central file, or that in some way the connection between your local file and the central file has been disrupted. Most of the time, if all the members of your team are very careful, this shouldn't happen. But in my experience, it has happened on occasion. If you follow the steps we laid out in the previous lessons, this shouldn't be an issue. But if you do come up with this problem, then the first thing that you're going to have to do is sit down with your teammates and discuss who's done what, who's worked on what different tasks, and really who's worked on it more. At this point, because we have two different distinctions of items, that is to say, for example, uh, let's say in level one, that John moved this elevation tag over here. Oh, that didn't stick. Let me get it back there. Okay, and Sally moved this elevation tag over here, but then Sally was disconnected. What you're going to have to do is find out which person has done more work. You'll need to determine whether it was Sally moving her tag over to the one side, or whether it was John moving his tag. And the reason for this isn't about assigning blame or credit. It's that now that we've lost the connection to the central file, we're going to have to resave a local file as the central file. So you'll want to go with the person who's done the most work, because once that file is saved as the central file, it'll effectively erase what your other colleagues have done. And again, as far as Revit is concerned, this is pretty much a worst case scenario. Just know that if it does happen, you will have to create a new central file so all your teammates can continue to work. It's pretty rare that it happens, but it's important enough that I felt it was necessary to go over the steps on how to fix it. Now to actually save the new central file, I'll normally go Start, Save As, Project. I'll then click Options, and under the File Save Options dialog, after you've set up your maximum number of backups, check the box that says Make This a Central Model After Save. In addition, I like to click the Compact File button. This keeps the file from saving unnecessary information and getting too bloated. Once you've chosen your options, you can click OK. Now you can choose whatever directory you need to save it in and give it a name. For this instance, I'm going to call this file Recovery. Once you have your save file ready to go, you can hit the Save button. Now it's going to take a couple of extra seconds to save everything since it's going to be saving it as the central file, and the compact files take a little bit longer. Then I'm going to close that file out, because you'll want to close out of that central file before you actually start working. Now we'll go back to Open and create a new central file. Again, by clicking on Open, selecting our new central file, and making sure the Create New Local button is checked. If we didn't close out of the central file, that would wind up corrupting our teammates again. So it is absolutely essential, if you're dealing with a corrupted central file, that once you have it fixed, you create a new local file on your computer. So remember, when you're working under collaboration settings, there's a few things to remember. First of all, that you're not working in the central file, and second, that you create a new local file every time, and that you never detach it from the central file. If you and your teammates are diligent in following these instructions, then you should never actually have to see this error message. Alright, that covers it for central files and how to deal with corrupted central files. Just remember, if you have a corrupted central file, you'll need to save your furthest along local file as the new central file. See you in the next lesson.